Hello, hello. Here we are at El Palmar uh, Sintacon in uh, the northwest of Tenerife. And this is a particular intriguing example because it has a number of quarries here. And they dig, they dug into um, the uh, Sintacon in a radial fashion. So people are still digging there, actually getting lapilli out. And these lapilli are there for agriculture as well as for cement supplement. And uh, here you see that there's a little bit of terracing going on gardening these lapilli uh, or gardening on the lapilli because they're very good they make for a very good soil and uh, people often ask what's going on there why is this radial pattern of quarries in this uh, particular sintacone and the simple answer is that uh, the uh, different slices of the sintacone are owned by different people and each of them was making uh, his or her own quarry there so uh, this is uh, a chopped up kind of cake slice uh, volcano and uh, different uh, people were making their own quarries and of course this is not very nice to look at from a uh, environmental point of view the landscape is a bit kind of yeah um, demolished here and uh, this is a bit sad that uh, the use of these materials in agriculture has led to the deterioration of the pristine landscape here but uh, the other aspect is that uh, they have allowed many more people to live in these islands uh, because of the more fertile soil, because of the moisture being retained much better in the soil and also because of the fertilization uh, potential of these lapilli. They can give a lot of potassium and phosphorus and nitrogen uh, etc. to the soil and uh, micro uh, microorganisms can live in these volcanic particles and they will break down the particles and uh, that also means more CO2 is sequestered into the soil and uh, the weathering of these particles also often leads to carbonation of minerals therefore also fixing more CO2 in the soil. So this is one of these intriguing situations where the degradation of one thing like the landscape, the uh, pristine volcanic landscape here might actually lead to some good somewhere else and that is feed more people and help the environment in particularly getting more CO2 fixed in soil. So I'd like to kind of thank you for your attention and we're going to go down the road here now towards Buena Vista in the northwest of Tenerife and uh, I guess it's time for a little coffee stop. So thank you for your attention and all the very best.